Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Nick from Noobkill coming at you another Madden video. Uh, today, I just got some Madden cash and I'm gonna open up the most feared packs. So, it says it can claim, uh, contains a most, most feared player, two gold or better players, and a mix of three other players or trophies. Uh, I'm gonna leave a link in the description of all the players you can get from the pack packs. And what's special about these packs is during um, during Halloween and the Halloween weekend, all the players that are most feared they get uh, enraged or boost for their overall rating. Uh, they came out on Friday, and they gave everybody a free pack, and everybody got them. Kahal Mac. I hope I'm not pronouncing that name wrong. Um, but yeah, he's rated 80 overall, and during that weekend, he goes to a 95 or 96 overall, so that's pretty nice. But everybody got that card, so you guys can't make a profit off him. But I'm gonna try to get something lucky for you guys. So let's get into it. Let's get in the first pack. So there's JJ, the first pack. I'm lagging right now. Two du dupes in one pack. And my most feared player is Don Donald Penn. Yep. And, okay. Let's go to the second pack. What? Oh, that's kind of sad. They have 75 overalls. A uh, Kyle Long, most feared. Let's see. He goes to a 94 during during that weekend. Not bad, but seeing a 95. Okay, let's get in the third pack. Okay. Matt. Sol, sorry, I can't pronounce that name, but 84, 84 overall, um, 96 during the weekend. That's not a bad pull. Right. Second last pack. Look at that right there. Uh, I'm actually happy. This is nice. Clay Matthews, 87. Same rating as the regular player card, but he goes to a 96 during the weekend. I'm happy with that. I like Clay Matthews a lot. So, I have his regular card, but I might replace it because that, that's a cool looking picture. Alright, let's go for the last pack. Hopefully we can get something. <clears throat> and there's the most feared. Chris Kante. 96 so mostly everybody goes from 96 overall the only one that goes higher than that i've seen so far is the jj watt and i've talked about his set already but what's cool in the live events they're doing these these stadiums things so you just do the thing um do the live event you can get a stadium collectible card and then you can use that towards the set which is pretty cool and i hope you guys enjoyed that video Please hit that subscribe button and like this video and I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.